don't worry, old man, I'm not going to hurt you, or something to that effect. And he didn't. But he committed a crime. People in the Meridian are calling it a crime of opportunity, one that doesn't exclude even the most vulnerable among us. Tonight, WDSU anchor LaTanya Norton is on your side with a robbery committed by the so-called nice bandit. But he always comes up swinging with his canes. He's 69 years old, frail, handicapped, and one of the most recent victims of crime in New Orleans. Surveillance video captured it all Friday morning around 11 o'clock at the intersection of Turo and Royal Streets in the Marigny. The NOPD says the elderly man was approached by a suspect who placed him in a bear hug and robbed him of his wallet. A bear hug. It was like from behind. Yeah. And he didn't. Didn't hurt him or rough him up or anything, but I think uh, my friend got a little bit nervous. There was a mutual respect, I'm told, between the robber and the victim who doesn't want to go on camera. He says repeatedly, the robber told him, I won't hurt you, even propped him up at times to keep him from falling. It's the second time the victim's been robbed in four years. If we got a nice bandit, he was, he was a nice bandit. This guy has been in this neighborhood before. Ken Karen is president of COPS 8, a group that supports the 8th District Police Station. He says the area has lots of cameras and more videos being turned over to police. I can guarantee this. This is not, this is not his first time doing it. He might have been nice this time, but who knows what have, uh, if he does it again or if he's done it in the past. The victim says the suspect appeared about 45 years old in paint spattered clothing and run down shoes down on his luck. But it doesn't matter. It still is a crime and it makes people feel unsafe. On your side, in the Marigny, LaTanya Norton, WDSU News. And some neighbors want more police visibility. Plans are in the works for security patrols on Frenchmen similar to the French Quarter Task Force. If you recognize the man in the video, call Crime Stoppers.